Stop memorizing hundreds of lead code problems and instead focus on the patterns to help you ace any interview. Today we're looking at graphs and matrices. Use this when you need to search graphs or matrices. Use DFS when you need to explore all possible paths such as maze exploration. Use BFS when you need to find the shortest path distance and use topological sort when you need task ordering. Let's start with DFS. In DFS, we explore as far as possible along each branch before backtracking, making it suitable for problems like pathfinding in mazes or tree traversal where deep exploration is prioritized. The flip side to this is BFS. In BFS, we scan level by level, first exploring all child nodes before we scan anything else. BFS is used to find the shortest path distance in an unweighted graph. Next up, we have topological sort. Topological sort is used for DAGs, direct acyclic graphs, where you have prerequisite nodes that you must visit before you visit other nodes. Note that node 0 points to node 1 and node 2. So node 0 is a prerequisite to visit nodes 1 and 2. And so topological sort is trying to find the ordering that's valid where you need to explore all the prerequisite nodes before the nodes that require them. Topological sort uses a variation of DFS to keep track of which nodes to visit first, and we can also visit islands separately such as 5, 6, and 8. Next up we have matrix traversal. Once again we have the concept of DFS, where DFS explores the maximum possible path and BFS explores layer by layer using the child nodes. If you'd like to learn every single lead code pattern that you absolutely need to know for all your tech interviews with coding templates and lead code questions to solve, be sure to check out my blog at blog.codeinmotion.io. If you'd like to see the Blind75 list in animated format, be sure to check out my YouTube channel.